Hello everyone, welcome back to High School Mathematics channel. Today we are going to learn class 8, chapter 6, squares and square roots, exercise 6.4, 6 to 9 sums. See now question number 6. Find the length of the side of a square whose area is 441 meters square. Let us see the solution. Area of the square that is side of a square into side of a square. Area of the square they have given as 441 meter square that equals to side of a square whole square. So side of a square equals to the square on transposing it becomes square root so square root of 441 that equals to now we have to find square root for the number 441. First we have written the given number in pairs. So last two digits we have written in pair. First one digit left over. Now the first number is 4. So we had 2 square means 4. So let us write here 2 square 4. 4 minus 4 0. Write on the next pair that is 41. 2 double value 4. Now we are going to multiply here by 1. So here 1 and in the quotient 1 we have written. So 41 ones are 41. So 41 minus 41 remainder 0. Therefore square root for this number is 21. Therefore, side of a square equals to square root of 441 that equals to 21 meters. See now question number 7. In a right angle triangle ABC, angle B equals to 90 degrees. See here in this question A. If AB equals to 6 cm, BC equals to 8 cm, find AC. Let us see the solution. Given AB equals to 6 cm, BC equals to 8 cm, we need to find AC value. According to Pythagoras theorem, AC square equals to AB square plus BC square. That equals to AB value is 6. So 6 square plus BC value is 8. So 8 square. That equals to 6 square means 6 into 6 that is 36. Plus 8 square means 8 into 8 that is 64. So AC square equals to 36 plus 64 that is 100. Now AC equals to square root of 100. Square root of 100 answer is 10. Therefore, AC value is 10 cm. See now, 7th question B sum. If AC value equals to 13 cm, BC value equals to 5 cm, find AB. Let us see the solution. Given AC value equals to 13 cm, BC value equals to 5 cm. Now, let us find AB value. According to Pythagoras theorem, AC square is equal to AB square plus BC square. Given AC value is 13, so AC square means 13 square, that equals to AB value unknown, so write the same AB square plus BC value is 5, so BC square means 5 square, that implies 13 square means 169, that equals to AB square plus 5 square means 25. Now AB square equals to 169 plus 25 on transposing it is minus 25. So, 169 minus 25 that equals to 144. That implies AB square is equals to 144. That implies AB equals to square root of 144. So, its value is 12. Therefore, AB value is 12 centimeter. See now question number 8. A gardener has 1000 plants. He wants to plant these in such a way that the number of rows and the number of columns remain same. Find the minimum number of plants he needs more for this. Now let us see the solution. Number of plants that is 1000 plants they have given. Now we have to find square root for this number 1000. The square root of 1000 can be calculated by long division method. Here we have taken 1000 number and we have written it in pairs. So first two digits is 10. So we have taken 3 square that is 9. So 10 minus 9, 1. Write on the next pair that is double 0. Now the number is 100. 3 double value, 6. So we have to write 6 here. Now we are going to multiply by 1 here. So 61 into 1 that is 61. 100 minus 61 we get a reminder 39. Here the reminder is 39. Clearly it shows that 31 square is less than 1000 value by 39. Now let us take 31 square next square value that is 32 square and subtract this 1000 from that number so that we get the perfect square. See here the square of 32 is 1024 
Hence, the number to be added to 1000 to make it a perfect square is 1024 minus 1000 that is 24. Thus, the required number of plants is 24. See now question number 9. There are 500 children in a school. For a PT drill, they have to stand in such a manner that the number of rows is equal to number of columns. How many children would be left out in this arrangement? Let us see the solution. Number of children in a school that is 500. Now let us find square root for the number 500. The square root of 500 can be calculated by using long division method. We have written here 500 and write them in pairs. We have taken here 2 square that is 4. So 5 minus 4, 1. Write on the next pair of digits that is double zero. Now the number is 100. 2 double value is 4. Here we have taken 2 and also in the coefficient 2. So 42 into 2 that is 84. 100 minus 84 remainder is 16. Here the remainder is 16. It shows that 22 square is less than 500 by 16. Therefore, perfect square can be obtained by subtracting 16 from the given number. Therefore, required perfect square is 500 minus 16 that is 484. Therefore, square root of 484 answer is 22. Therefore, number of children left out in the drill arrangement is 16 children. Today we have seen class 8 chapter 6 exercise 6.4 6 to 9 sums. By this we have completed this chapter. Hope you like this video. If you like this video please like, share to your friends and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.